everyone welcome back and we're going to look at another protocol cigar this is the bass reeves this is the maduro version and you'll know see why i did that in a minute six by 52 toro there is the density now bass reeves was the first u.s marshal to be black and he was famous back in the 1800s for his arrest and uh, protocol was all about law enforcement so that's why he's here now this cigar uh, just like the natural version is 6x52 but this uses a dark Nicaraguan Habano wrapper so it's not necessarily Maduro but it's dark and it is Maduro-esque Comes in boxes of 10 made in the San Latano factory. So let's get right to it. The new Protocol Bass Reeves Maduro. All right, let's remove the band. It's just that difficult right there. All right. Another effortless draw. Interesting start. Cedar, apricot, a lot of black coffee, nutmeg, light citrus peel, dry cocoa. Black pepper at about eight, seven and a half, eight, maybe eight plus. It's a lot of black pepper again in this cigar. Interesting start, very dark. Has some sweetness though. Nice start actually. Very dark noted. So also let's see what we have in the first third. This is a pretty good start. First third. And then Let's see. Let me try to pin down the flavors. Just settle down some. Apricot, light, cedar, and citrus. Light. I still it's there. Brown sugar. Dry cocoa. Dry nutmeg. Black coffee. And a little bit of toffee in the mix too. Very. Very hard to pin down the flavors of this cigar. There's just so many going on and it's fairly dark noted. The finish is toffee, black coffee, and a little nutmeg with very good lingering black pepper. Medium bodied. 
somewhat leaning already toward medium to full, but it's medium at this point. But this is a tasty cigar. Uh, it's a, uh, is dark noted and a lot of really varied sweet notes. A little more interesting than the natural was. I like it. The first third I rate 94. We're gonna have to see how it plays out because these cigars change from third to third. But right now it's good. In the second third, black coffee is really coming out. You got light apricot, light citrus peel, brown sugar, toffee, and elevated black coffee. I don't really have the cocoa notes anymore. Medium and full. <laughs> Finishes some toffee, black coffee, and a little nutmeg with very good lingering black pepper. Cigar got a little darker, quite a bit darker with that black coffee. I would rate the second, third, 93. Still good, and it's getting a little more strength involved, and we're getting a little better burn time out of this cigar than we did the natural. Don't know why, but we are. Interesting cigar, though. A lot going on. And, it's, and, and to be honest with you, there is so much going on, it's a little hard to pin down everything. So I have to really think about it. Doesn't uh, just pop, everything pop out. There's a lot of subtleties to it. So let's see how we wrap it up. to the end so let's wrap it up well the flavor sort of condensed down to four light apricot toffee light dry nutmeg and black coffee full body finishes toffee black coffee and very good lingering black pepper a lot of black pepper in the cigar also It jumped in strength and it condensed in flavors. Nice flavors, not, not a problem. <clears throat> but this is a, in my opinion, a little better cigar than the natural. The natural was just so full of dry nutmeg, so full of it. And this is pretty full of black coffee with nice sweet notes. A whole 93 for the final third. But these cigars, like most protocols, are pretty good. I mean, you need to get to know protocol if you don't. Your overall score is 93.33. Really good. And comparing the two, the Maduro, I have at a point better than the natural. The natural was interesting, even with all that dry nutmeg, but this is a little better. So that'll do it. The new Protocol Bass Reeves Maduro, 93.33. Mm.